From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Adam Hammond with your morning headlines this Friday morning. Breaking overnight, the father of a three-year-old boy found dead in a hot car in Smyrna is now behind bars. Yesterday afternoon, emergency crews found three-year-old Dalen Palmer left unattended in that vehicle. His father, 23-year-old Dylan Levesky, was booked overnight facing an aggravated child abuse and neglect charge. Because of his age, he's considered a Class A felon, which carries a prison sentence between 15 and 60 years. That's what he's charged with. Levesky's bond is set at $50,000, and that investigation is ongoing this morning. Also breaking overnight, two people are recovering this morning after a shooting south of Nashville. Police say this happened on Winthorne Drive about 10 o'clock last night. A man was shot in the arm, taken to the hospital, and officers say a woman was also hospitalized after having cardiac issues after witnessing that shooting. There's no information yet on a gunman or a motive. Crews had to work pretty quickly to contain and fix a water main break at first into Mumbry and overnight. It took hours to fix this mess. Look at this. This happened downtown. They say at one point water was shooting six feet into the air. They had to open fire hydrants on Broadway to help relieve some of that water pressure. And crews say hitting the line was an accident. Now let's get a check on your forecast. It's the weekend forecast with Leland. All right, around the Mid-South for today, we've got a chance for some scattered showers along and south of Interstate 44 today as the front has hung up around that area. For today, look for a high of around 90, and then for tonight down to 71, 91 tomorrow. Area showers and thunderstorms in the weekend forecast and early next week. Right now, we'll play with those percentages or keep an eye on those percentages depending on the track that Tropical Storm Barry may take over the weekend into next week. Have a fantastic weekend.